Hey, guess what's going on here? I just, uh, beat day 11. Realized I was not recording my audio the entire time, and now I have to redo it. Yay. I don't know. It, it's been stated many times that it is impossible for me to put out a video without getting some kind of tech issue. This just kind of proves that statement, I guess. By the way, baby otters. You'll be seeing those in a bit. Um, so, guess we're doing this again. Luckily, my commentary on the last one wasn't that great anyway, so I might be able to improve it slightly. I still hate having to redo stuff because it just makes it seem less genuine. But anyway, I will uh, begin this day by uh, doing what I found to work best. Um... I actually had to reset that last one a couple times, just from Pikmin deaths, and, um, I found that this is the group I want to bring in, um, 52 reds specifically because that's how many flowers I have, and then just a couple yellows for something you'll see in a minute. But, uh, anyway, pointless thing to talk about here while getting to the area. The story will take 25 minutes, it will take me only one minute to get there, so it will not work out so well, but, um, basically there's this, uh, we yesterday recorded some funky stuff, um, it'll be uploaded later this week, I guess I don't really have to say what it is yet, but, uh, yeah, there, there's, this, I'm, I'm ignoring you, I'm gonna check this thing out in a minute, but, uh, yeah, 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 totally not gonna trigger a boss fight or anything. Anyway, recorded some funky stuff, and then after we were done with that, um, it was like, it was me, Brenna, and Joel doing it, um, <clears throat> then afterwards, I'm like, well, I feel like watching the Demented Cartoon movie again, because I haven't seen that in a while, and I like watching stupid shit with Joel, because he enjoys that stuff as well, um, and I'm like, Brenna, you're going to hate this, I know this perfectly well. So you have the ability to leave if you want to, but I feel like you should at least watch part of it. Uh, she did not actually leave. She fell asleep. I thought that was kind of awesome, because it's like, how do you fall asleep in a Flash movie where there's an explosion going off every two seconds? But it happened anyway. So we'll just go ahead and uh, dig up the cell phone here. Nothing's bad's going to happen. No reason for this to be a cutscene. Oh my god, what is this? Say hello to the puking cat cake, also known as the belching mirror slug. <clears throat> it is the puking cat cake, though. I don't care what anyone says. Anyway, now that it's actually shown itself, I will collect these. Because it digs a big hole. You don't want to get st stuck in the hole. Sad things will happen if you do. <clears throat> so yeah, you generally want to stay away from this hole. Anyway, we watched the Dimension Cartoon movie. Um... Then I decided to look it up on TV Tropes to see if it had an entry, which it did. And I came across just a page for Animutation in general. And from there, I found an entire wiki about Animutations. And this wiki is just the most freaking insane thing I've ever seen. Because of the fact that they actually categorize a lot of this shit, like, and have no reason to. Like, for example, like, every animutation that they have tracked on there has, like, a cast list of all the different, like, random pictures of shit that appear within the animation. And so, like, of course, because it's animation, like, every single one of them includes, like, Colin Mockery and Zippy and JJ the Jet Plane and stupid stuff like that. But then you'll also just get, like, Guy with Sweater, like weird dancing kid gif like stuff like that and um the characters in it that uh appear in multiple animutations will usually get their own page dedicated to them and these pages are so shitty like well it depends on the character like some of them go way way more in depth than they would have any right to and some of them are just like one sentence there's very few that are actually just in between but uh, my favorite example of this was I found a page for Pillsbury Doughboy. The description for Pillsbury Doughboy on this... Anyway, let me uh, take a second here. 
You want to stay far away from this pit. It is not good to get stuck in this pit. I'm just going to keep doing this and hope that it works. Because there is no getting out of this pit if you get into it. Anyway, Pillsbury Doughboy. Here's the description that was listed on the, on the page. The Pillsbury Doughboy is the mascot of the Pillsbury Food Company. He, he laughs when you poke his belly. He was strangled by Santa Claus. I, I'm just gonna leave it at that. Because that's where the freaking article ended, so why should I add any more? Strangled by Santa Claus, all you need to know. I don't know when this happened or what the context was behind it, but it sounds like something that would happen in an animutation, so I'll buy it. Okay, so can we attack this thing? Go ahead and fart out some magic spray onto my Pikmin here. Oh, also, I need to take a picture of this thing. Um, I did get a picture in the other attempt, but because it was lost and I didn't want to bother keeping the footage for it. I guess I have to get another picture. So, can we get one real quick? Where is it? Oh god, it's got, like, makeup. What is this? What is this? It's terrible looking. And, of course, it lives. Oh well, that was a much better picture than last time. I'm glad I did that, because that picture was, like, completely messed up. Alright, can we just kill this guy? It needs, like, two hits. Oh, shit. And there it goes. I think it's dead, guys. Let's teleport over here and watch it puke out a watermelon and a cell phone. With a picture of baby otters on it. Which, I do have to admit, yes, they are ferrets. They are not actually baby otters. But I'm going to call them baby otters anyway because they were cute. So anyway, let me go ahead and gather this crap. I am going to... I'm going to Gamelon. No, I don't know. Um, I'm going to let the Rock Pikmin get the body because I keep saying that I'm going to grow more of them and then I never do. And I could be like, oh, I'm going to get this body here with the reds. We'll carry it part way back, and then I'll stop them. It won't work. I'll forget. Okay. So, can we carry the cell phone, actually? Hold on. How many do we need? Okay, that worked out well. Brittany, come on. <clears throat> and that's pretty much all I have planned for the day. Um... Last, in the last recording of this, I did kind of a little exploration thing, but I didn't actually collect anything, because I don't think there's really much else I can do until I get blues. I can do some messing about with uh, yellows in this one area, though. I might be able to do something with those. But first things first, let me grab the rock Pikmin. Let them get the body. And I took a wrong turn at Albuquerque. Um... Oh, I also wanted to point out that uh, one of those data logs says you can use bomb rocks against it. Um, that is technically true, but you have to bring the bomb rocks in. There's none actually in the arena, so that's kind of lame. I also have no idea if this is going to need all 45. I think it only needs like 20, but I'd like to see how many can actually carry it. And I didn't bother bringing a smaller group. I don't know. Doesn't matter, I guess. I also probably should have left two of the captains behind, so then I don't have to backtrack. I am smart. So, you start going back. Meanwhile... What was that camera angle? Let's see, how many can get this? I know more than 29, come on. Eh, whatever. Okay, so let me follow this 
Uh, I love when you just bypass Pikmin that are carrying stuff like that. It makes no sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, it's showing the cell phone. Okay. Guess it is good to go over this, even though it's pretty much the same exact dialogue from the last time they found something. Just like, gasp, what is this magic technology that we do not know anything about, even though we have faster than light travel? I mean, maybe they just found different ways to communicate other than cellular technology, so they just don't know what this is, but I don't know. Had to keep the squeaking the entire time, though. It was necessary. Alright. So, where's the crab? He is... Where the hell is that thing, actually? It's up there. I'm gonna see if I can fight that crab, actually. Just to have something to do. And as soon as I start getting all these new fruit recovered messages, I will uh, switch over and put some of the Pikmin away, because the body is going to spawn 50 rock Pikmin, and I would like those to actually come out of the onion so they have a chance to flower, rather than just letting them stay right in there. Yeah. Also, can we see the star fruit? Yep, there it is. There's a star fruit up there. It is semi difficult to reach. Make sure the crab does not attack me. And perfect. Yep, there comes the body. Okay. I might uh, do some stuff with yellows in a bit here then, but let me see if I can take care of this crab first. The peckish Arista crab, if you want to be specific. Is he going to come over here? Yeah, here he comes. Come on. Uh, camera? Am I not sucking? Come on. Come over here. Leaf, get out of the way. Man, I can't see shit in this fight. I don't think it can kill Pikmin once the claw's dead. Oh, I'm kind of throwing them really deep into that water. I should probably stop that. And it got a couple. Shit. Uh. Alright, there we go. Uh, can we please break the claw off? There we go. Now that the claw is gone, I'm pretty sure it's kind of harmless. Um, I don't know if it will regenerate the claw, though. Or if it'll, like, come back over here. It might be too smart for that. So let me actually uh, send Alf back. Because I don't really need the rock Pikmin anymore. Oh. Thank you, guys. God damn it. I forgot that they would pluck Pikmin if they were left to their own devices. So much for that idea. Oh, well. I, at least I got a bunch more rock pack when I go, so. so, you head back over there. After I figure out what direction I'm moving in. I'm gonna check out the weird, uh... What the hell are you guys? I've seen these before, I just, I don't know what they do. Or if there's any point to actually fight them. Also, did I just lose Pikmin somewhere? It's really hard for me to keep track of that. I don't think I did. But I heard like a ha <laughs> kind of noise. And I'm not sure why. So I'm going to leave the crab alone for a minute, actually. Let me see what this does. How this works, rather. Um, what do you mean there's two out? Where are they? There better not be no dang two Pikmin. What is this shit? You seriously... What? <sighs> I 
Okay, hold on. Gotta get the one little watermelon crumb left over. There might be enough time for... Oh, you are a piece of shit, you freaking game. I did not want everybody. That is why I sent just one. And what are you running away from? There's nothing here. Whatever. God. Okay, this day somewhat turned into a disaster. Um. But. Oh well. Not much could be done about it. I didn't plan on getting anything done more than the boss fight anyway, so... I'm not really, like, falling behind or anything. Please don't get led into the water. Guess what? They got led into the water. Can we get out? Kill the thing. Kill it. Wow, these things are annoying. Okay, um, I think everything... No, there's still two Pikmin unaccounted for. Um, let me get these back to base, just to make sure they're not interfering with my count somehow. So, Charlie's got one. Where the fuck are the other two? I didn't go down in that area. They're not up by the beach. Oh, they are over there. What? Hold on. Can I please change to Charlie? Why is it not letting me? There we go. God damn it. Okay, so the fruit's not done. Actually, don't even bother with it. You're not going to make it. Transition screens. I hate them. <sighs> okay, so what did we learn from this day? Transition days... Transition screens suck. The crab sucks. Everything sucks. No, it's it's fine, I guess. Um, didn't go quite as well as I had hoped. Um... Like, I, I, got, I got through the boss fight pretty quickly. It went well. There was only one death, or were there no deaths? I don't even remember. Um, lost a couple to the crab, but yeah. Um, so that part was fine. Not happy about the fact that none of those rock Pikmin got flowered up, but I'll hopefully find Nectar eventually. Uh, that's pretty much all I have to say about that one, I guess. Now let's see how this goes. Um... I did not technically collect the entire fruit. Like, if you remember back to uh, when I mentioned that thing about, like, doing a no-fruit run because you never actually collect entire pieces of it, uh, this actually, I think, would count towards that. I would have gotten three bottles if I had gotten that one extra little bit. But, uh... I don't really have anything else to say. I'm just, I'm very flustered and or custard at the moment. So, yeah, I think we lost one to the boss and then one to the crab. Unless we just lost three to the crab, I don't even know. Whatever, not redoing this day again. I'm gonna stick with it. One day I will have to come back, get that piece of watermelon, show it who's boss. Not the mirror slug, the watermelon. And that is all. Um, because we got the cell phone, we're going to uh, be able to access a new area, so that'll be good. Uh, we'll be checking that out next time. And I do know what area it is, but I will not say it. Not that it matters. And...